Remy Ma called out a task force within the New York Police Department that is known for aggressively monitoring high-profile hip-hop artists and deems whether they pose a risk worthy for police interference. The rap unit team then sends the information to local precincts and officers out on the field. These officers then share any information they have on shootings or other criminal proceedings that have occurred at clubs in the area. Records obtained by the New York Post show that officers associated with the unit are also tied to the New York, New Jersey High Intensity Drug Trafficking Area a program that utilizes federal money and resources to go after narcotic operations. The NYPD had an officer undercover and in March 2018 showed that Remy Ma was attending at Irving Plaza that featured surprise cameos from a half dozen other New York rappers including Lil' Kim They also had at least 24 officers patrolling outside the Manhattan venue Got neither were wanted for a crime at the time of the surveillance at Irving Plaza The Wake Me Up rapper has since been arrested in May for allegedly attacking her love and hip-hop New York co-star Britney Taylor during a benefit concert at Irving Plaza in April Ma has pleaded not guilty and is out on parole for the attack. She is set to stand trial for the misdemeanor on July 12 Elliot, however, was deemed a person of interest for his suspected ties to Bronx-based gang Dub City. He also has been arrested 26 times. He was indicted in 2012 for being connected to a violent turf war that involved 15 shootings, including one that killed a member of the gang, authorities shared. Elliot would serve 2.5 years for a felony drug possession conviction. He was paroled in November 2016. Prior to his joining Dub City, Elliot was said to have previously been associated with a known crew known as the Mac Ballas, according to an undated memo written by officers in the 13th Precinct. Intel revealed that Jamik's new crew association has caused tension with the Mac Ballas and there may be possible retaliation against him, the intelligent officer's memo states. Ma's lawyer, Don Florio, rejected the notion that the two were connected. Remy does not know Johnny Elliott. Never heard of him, doesn't know him, Florio said. She does not travel in an entourage. She travels with her husband and security guards. Florio stated that the rapper is not a fan of the hip hop police. My impression of the hip-hop police is they're this shadowy, specialized unit that conducts overly aggressive investigations, she said They're constantly stalking high-profile rap artists and monitoring their every move But Sergeant Jessica McCrory, an NYPD spokeswoman, asserted the Enterprise Operations Unit focuses on venues or entertainers that have been connected with past acts of violence, regardless of musical genre. The primary goal of the OU is to anticipate, based on past incidents, where there is a significant likelihood of violence and to take steps to prevent people from being hurt or worse. Share this article share Shia added that the unit has aided in several major prosecutions and continues to gather additional intelligence by responding to shootings and assaults that may occur at all kinds of entertainment venues. 
Dot rapper 50 Cent celebrated his birthday at the venue in 2017, but for a scheduled performance at the club in 2016, a sergeant at Patrol Borough Brooklyn South reached out to the 72nd Precinct to see if security was needed. Any plan being put into effect for 50 Cent appearing on Thursday at Club Lust, the email stated. It is unknown what action the police took, if any. The NYPD sent a New Year's Day email warning the rap unit of his upcoming Trap Tuesday appearance at the venue the next day. They shared a promotional flyer with the 72nd Precinct. Jersey City rapper Albie Al, whose real name is Albert Robinson, was another artist who was slated to appear at Club Lust and who had a report made on him. The rap unit wrote up a five-page report establishing a connection between the musician and multiple shootings in the New Jersey State area in anticipation for his July 2016 performance at the venue. Albial was said to have been a known blood member, with the report adding that he was acquitted of a June 2014 killing. The rapper was also said to have been suspected or ordering a May 2016 hit in Elizabeth, New Jersey. The altercation resulted in a revenge shooting by the victim's brother that left the rapper injured. The report states, the EOU will continue to observe for any future events where Al Bial will be in attendance. In addition, any of these future events that are found will be classified as high events for future weekly entertainment reports. Dot but rap unit officers asserted, there's no need to worry about him. Kodak is a loud mouth knucklehead. However, there have been no issues with him and Nick. In addition, has on probation. So if he does anything wrong at all, has going right back to jail and has aware of that as well as his people around him. The detectives also noted that Black was arrested earlier today for parole violation and is being held without bail in the state of Florida. So it's possible that and more than likely that we won't even be attending this event at last. Dot dot if it'll make your co feel better, if he does get out of jail, which I doubt, in time to go to this event, I will reach out to him management and speak with him. But like I said, has simply a big mouth young kid. He's actually intimidated of Nick. So he just wants to fulfill his contract and then leave. The appearance at Club Lust was eventually cancelled.